my story looks like a lot of stories in Mexico. I really start from the bottom. I mean, I start from, from nothing. I think everyone in my family, in my football team, know that if I get into the NFL, that is a bless. Monterey is the city of the mountains. That's where the name came from. Mexico is a, is a country that everyone helps each other. There's a lot of friendship bonds. We have a, a lot of good stuff also in Mexico, not just insecurity and poverty. We also have too much love to, to give. Bueno, pues, yo tengo una familia que está conformada por cinco personas, mi esposo, mis tres hijos, no sé si conozcan a mis hijos, es Abraham, Isaac e Israel. We are not like the usual Mexican family. I'm 6'7", my old brother he's 6'5", and my young brother he's 6'4". Eh, mi tipo de familia, donde eh, creció Isaac, eh, temerosa de Dios, con principios eh, morales. I always thank thankful with my parents because everything I can like reach or everything I achieve is because of them because they teach me the right way. Pero a los tres nos motivan y los tres empezaron en esa manera a ser. Eh, sinergia. Siempre andan los tres juntos para todos lados. Bueno, mis hijos creo que tuvieron una infancia muy divertida, una infancia de mucho juego. Siempre salíamos en familia los fines de semana y siempre buscábamos un parque o incluso el fundidora y, y siempre mi esposo fue muy inclinado a, a jugar con el fútbol, con el balón de fútbol americano y a ellos les encantó, entonces desde, desde pequeños. A mí siempre me gustó este, el fútbol americano y pues dije, bueno, pues agarro un baloncito y se lo aviento. Como era muy veloz el niño, se lo aventaba y lo atrapaba. Quizás muy chiquitos no, quizás muy chiquitos ellos no lo, no lo veían, ellos se niegan en su juego. Pero en, en la etapa de la secundaria ya empezaron a sentirse más atraídos por ver algo profesional y ya en la prepa pues ya incursionaron ellos en el deporte. I started playing football when I was 14 years old. Since the first moment I played this sport, I, I love it. All my brothers play this sport. We play for the same college in Mexico. It's like a war. You are like with your brothers fighting for winning the game. I love that part. Fíjate, le permitió jugar y, 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 vi, y vi sus habilidades. Entonces, este, ahí vi yo que iba a poder tener un, un pues lo veía proyectado, verdad. A mí siempre me, me gustó llegar a ser, este, estar en las grandes ligas, pero pues las condiciones eran diferentes. Había muchos limitantes y aquí yo traté de darles todo eso. It was so hard because, I mean, I need to take my classes in my high school in the morning and after classes I need to walk to the bus station. So I need, I need to be like stand up in the middle of the bus like for an hour, go to my college, train in my college. And it was so hard, but it worth it. It's not just like, God, I want this, please give it to me. It's not like that. You need to put something about yourself. I mean, you need to work for that and work hard. If you want to be the best, you need to do more than anyone else. We were first made aware of Isaac uh, through some relationships we were able to build in the football community. When we went to Monterrey, 
it was hard not to see Isaac. She told me, okay, okay, this will be real quick, just to let you know that you're in the program. And I'm like, oh my God, all my family gets so happy about me. We go to the church, we praise God for this opportunity, and I'm here right now. The NFL Player Pathway program started in 2017 and it aims to identify talented athletes from around the world. The goal of the Player Pathway program is to give athletes from around the world an opportunity to make it in the NFL. Although he's young, he's mature enough to handle going to that situation. So, what we're gonna do, Isaac, you're gonna start us off right here. So, we start and we get into a good football pass protection position. I mean, there's pressure. You know that every day, there's one day less to be in, in our pro day. You know that after this, there are just like two paths. We all set on that? You are in or you are out. <laughs> so every day you need, to, you need to give everything you can give. Reload. When you look at Isaac's road to get into this point, things that stand out to me is, is his, really his dedication to this game. You know, he, he's six foot seven, he's 320 pounds. He ticks all the boxes from an athleticism perspective and to watch him really develop into an offensive tackle, really building on what he had started in Mexico and that could potentially translate to him having a successful career in the NFL. I'm a guy that always wants to improve. I'm never settled. I mean, I just want to improve in, every, in anything I can. I'm just a work guy. I love to work. I love to improve. And I think that's the thing they will like about me. Hey, Isaac. Wanted to say congratulations to you uh, on behalf of Mr. Jones, the Jones family, uh, Coach McCarthy, and Cowboys Nation. You know, we're and myself, we're excited to have have you uh, join us. Um, you know, player from Mexico. This is a big deal for Mr. Jones. You know, uh, as far as the Mexican American fans in in, in uh, the United States, 54% are Cowboys fans. So you're going to have a bunch of people rooting for you. There you go. That's it. Looks good on you. Without God, I can't do anything. I didn't ask to be this tall. I didn't ask to have this talent. That's grace. That's what he wants to give me. And I want to use that talent that he gave me to like, reach other people, to be a, an example for those kids in Mexico, to be an example for my country. Isaac is someone we've really enjoyed getting to know. He's one of the best human beings I've ever met. And when you take people who have been this dedicated to this sport, with really nothing else to, to kind of aim for, and you put them in the United States, and you base him at a training facility the way we do, and now when you put him at the star with the Dallas Cowboys, and you immerse him and give him everything that he needs and that, he, that he's that he been striving to get. Think of the potential of what that is gonna cause to happen. Don't let anyone tell you what you can achieve or what you, can, you cannot achieve. If you want something, you work for being there. There are a lot of, a lot of Mexicans that work really hard, I mean, their life is, is hard. I just want to be, I just want to make Mexico feel proud about me. I think the future is so bright now for a country with such a history of playing the game that hopefully we can shine a spotlight on, on the successes they've been able to have to give more people uh, the same opportunities as Isaac. Just don't want to be a football player. I want to be an example for my country. I want to bring hope to the Mexicans. 